Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of the GT Online Top 5 Community Plays. Today's theme is a wild card, which means we have a variety of different clips to show off. Next week is going to be takedowns in land vehicles, and if you are interested in submitting a clip for a chance to be featured, the instructions can always be found in the description of every one of my videos. Starting us off today is Pokemonster, and he's delivering some hangar cargo when he gets attacked by a jet and has to make an evasion. I have no clue how it got out of that alive, but it looked really smooth. I thought it would have definitely died when the jet shot the cannons at the Savage, but I guess he was far enough away from the blast radius, luckily. And then to make things even better, the jet crashes into the empty helicopter and gives him the kill. All in all, just a great turn of events. At number 4 is Captain Ghosty with quite the cinematic takedown. He just gets a small piece of the tail rotor with an explosive round of the heavy sniper which destroys the rotor and then while the helicopter is spinning out of control it smacks right into the bridge and blows up. That's like something you'd see in like a cutscene or a scripted event. Everything just happened so perfectly and it looked really cool. At number 3 we have Twisty's toaster and his night shark gets lit up by pressure missiles so afterwards he gets some sweet revenge. Super clean snipe right there in between the tower, kind of a difficult angle too, the oppressor was going upwards and he hit him with the first shot, just nice drag scope for that kill, very nicely done. In the number 2 spot is Penguin Flies with an insane Starling Bomb kill. So I trimmed the clip a bit just so you guys didn't have to wait to see what happened because the bomb was dropped from way above the clouds and it was a good 45 seconds from the bomb drop to when they actually made impact with the ground. And the best part is he actually went down to see them hit the target. I always like seeing really long bomb drops like these. You know, being skilled with the bombs will make you such a big threat in the Starling or really any other of the aircraft in the game that have bombs on them. It's also really funny how he lags out right afterwards. I mean, at least he got the kill first. And at the number one spot this week is Falcon Airlines, and the timing of this kill, or should I say these kills, was just unbelievable. So it's kind of hard to tell what happened at full speed, but slowing it down it makes it much easier to see what actually happened. He hit the first guy with an explosive round and knocked him over, but he didn't die. Then when he went for the second shot, an oppressor flew right by his screen like two inches away from him, and he somehow ends up hitting the initial guy he was aiming for, and the guy flying by on the oppressor with one shot. I don't think I've ever seen a collateral with an explosive round before. I didn't even think it was possible, but according to this clip, it sure is. That was just freaking amazing. Anyways, that's going to be all for this episode of the Top 5 Community Plays. The next theme, again, is going to be takedowns in land vehicles, so you can use anything from a Stromberg, a tank, or any other land vehicle. It doesn't even have to be a weaponized vehicle. And if you'd like to submit a clip for a chance to be featured, the instructions can be found in the description of all my videos. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, as well as subscribe to my channel for more guide and PvP-related content. Huge thank you to my channel sponsors for your support. If you'd like to become a member for some exclusive perks, you can either use the join button or the link that's down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.